Today, we're going to build a droid control ship using 14 Lego pieces. These are all the pieces you are going to need. In the description of this video, I left the piece names, count, and design IDs. To build the side of our droid control ship, we're going to get two of these slope pieces. I, they're pretty big ones, like three by two by one. I'll put the actual name um, in the description of this video. But what we're going to do is we're going to take these two slope pieces and put them together so that those studs in the center are connected. We've got that little divot. And how we're going to hold it together is we're going to get one of these one by two grill plates. And we're just going to put that grill plate right here. Now this is originally a Lego Star Wars advent calendar design. And for them, they put a one by two just plate and it just didn't look right because the side of the the control ship is you know it's greater there's grooves there's no bump so I, I didn't like the, the stud sticking out so we're putting in a grill there and I really like that effect a lot more and of course we are going to do that two times and here I used a metallic color and here I used a dark gray just kind of give it some different shades of color but you can use whatever you like and then so once I've got these down done I'm going to get a Travis brick and the big hole in the Travis Brook is going to be the back of our um, command ship here and um, where the engines are. And to do that, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a jumper plate, a one by two jumper plate, and just put that into the back hole stud there. And then to create this like engine effect, I'm going to get two one by one round translucent plates. Don't know why I did that rolling in my tongue there, but we're going to put those round translucent plates into the back of our jumper plate to kind of create the engines of our command ship here that so it can go to different planets to create blockades and drop off the droids. Now on the top stud here, we're gonna get a one by one tile piece with the clip. And the reason we have this tile piece of the clip is it kind of creates that city that's on top and in the back of this command ship. And so we put that on to kind of create the effect of those towers. And to give it even more depth in life, we're gonna get a one L bar with the on a one by one round stud piece. We're gonna put that bar onto that front stud here and have it sticking up to just kind of create another tower and more life to the city that we're creating. And now on that stud of that bar piece, we're gonna get the bottom half of a dome in this metallic silver. We're gonna put that onto the stud like this. And then to close it off, create that big dome in the center of these command ships, we're gonna get the top half of the dome and just put it on top of that silver piece like this. And then you can kind of see how this thing is taking shape. And now we still have these side studs here. Well, those side studs, we're gonna put those kind of curved slopes we made earlier. I'm just gonna attach those onto the side and I'm gonna straighten out that tile piece and put those onto both sides. And here we have a droid command ship for the Trade Federation. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe or check out some of our other videos. Until next time, let's keep building together.